Hi, I'm Jack Canfield, America's number one success coach. You also may know me as the co-author of the Chicken Soup for the Soul series and as a featured teacher in the movie The Secret. I am here with Denise Winston, who is a national financial expert and also the author of the book Money Starts Here. Yep. I love this book. I love the picture of you on this book. It's great. <laughs> You are working in corporations doing financial wellness programs. Why is it so important that people and companies deal with the financial problems of their employees? You know, financial issues of employees are costing corporate America big bucks and it is really impacting their bottom line. And it is because when you have an employee that is financially stressed out, research shows that they spend about 20 hours a month on company time worrying about and dealing with their financial issues. That's half a week. It, 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 it's a huge yeah. amount of time. And you'll see it at the water cooler. A human Resources Department will see it by people asking for 401k loans, not contributing. You'll hear people you'll get bill collectors calling. Um, and when somebody's financially stressed out, their productivity goes down. Mm -hmm. And what happens, you've got lost time productivity, so they're not focused on their job. And even worse for a company, their, their benefits cost can go up. So we know that stress is the leading cause of disability claims. Somebody sure. goes out on disability. We've got workers' comp claims because somebody's distracted on the job. Um, you know, we have people calling in tardy all the time. We have them taking advantage of, you know, the employee benefits. So it's it's an incredible cost to our companies. And I know this at, because as a banker for 25 years, um, I saw it in my business. I had a staff of 25. They were bankers, but they still, you know, made six to ten financial decisions every day and I was the person fielding those calls and dealing with those claims. So um, it really transitioned into now that I left the banking industry and you know having worked with so many businesses and having my own business really and seeing how it impacted us and our bottom line and customer service and vendor relationships, I mean, it goes very, very, very deep. Why is it, do you think, I mean, uh, there's so many people, it's like an epidemic of people that have financial problems, there's a huge debt crisis in America, not just our federal government, but individuals. And where does this all come from? Why are we so, let's say, financially illiterate? Why are you know, we getting into so much trouble? Smart companies invest in financial literacy programs for their employees because mm -hmm. there is a huge ROI. And the reason why people simply uh, the bottom line, they never get the information they need. They get sucked into, you know, they graduate, they go to work, and they're sucked into this vicious cycle of basically earning and spending and earning and spending. And until we bring programs like what I offer to the staff, um, they're, they're just caught up in this cycle. And then it gets worse and worse, and, and they just never stop. And we, just like you're lost in the florist, you know, you need to stop. And mm -hmm. we hear about all the time these people getting um, lost on a trail. They just went for a day hike. And they took two steps off the path to look at the view and another two steps and off the path. And all of a sudden, they're so deep in the forest, they're lost. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times the employees simply don't know what to do. And as corporate America, we wonder why we are, are, are really struggling with our economy. Here's the deal. In my community alone, we put 11,000 financially un educated consumers on our streets and into our workforce and when they aren't able to have a checking account and not bounce checks and pay fees and they can't have good credit to buy cars and buy homes we wonder why our nation is struggling and there is some fundamental information essential information um, that they need in order for us to all improve and the good thing I'm not selling anything but knowledge Mm -hmm. um, I don't have, you know, 401k programs. I'm not an investment advisor. So it's a real safe, reliable, um, unbiased way for employees to obtain information that can change their lives in turn showing up better at work and being able to increase their productivity. Fabulous. I love it. Thanks. So if someone to find out more about your work mm -hmm. and what you do and mm -hmm. bring you into their company mm -hmm. or take advantage of that, mm -hmm. Where do they go? What do they do? They can actually go to denisewinston.com or moneystarthere.com. Those are two places you can find me for financial wellness programs or corporate programs. denisewinston.com and moneystartshere.com. Correct. Very good. So if you're smart, you'll go there and take advantage of what this woman has to offer your company and get some financial literacy in there. So these financial problems, which are creating all kinds of mm -hmm. you know, stress, in the lives of the company and also the people and also taking them away from being as productive as you would like right. them to be. Make sure you go to those websites, find out more about her work. Right. Thanks, Jack.
My pleasure. Thanks for joining me tonight. Thank you.